My name is Ken Brockman and currently I'm a consultant in nuclear safety applications for the American and international nuclear industry. Now, my academic background has been somewhat varied. I had three terms at the University of Louisville in chemical engineering and then went to the United States Military Academy at West Point. Completed my degree there in general engineering and in mathematics. I was then with the Westinghouse company and they gave me postgraduate studies in nuclear engineering and then completed with a master's in public administration from the American University. I retired from the Army in 1979 and was looking for a job. Westinghouse Corporation, as part of a job fair, presented an opportunity and uh, in discussions with them it just became quite obvious it was a great combination of both the leadership skills that I'd learned in the Army, the technical skills that I'd picked up from college and it was a logical connection between the two to bring them together. From 2003 to 2006, I was, had the honor to serve with the United Nations International Atomic Energy Agency in Vienna, Austria. In that capacity, I was the director of nuclear installation safety. My division during this time was responsible for developing the safety standards that are used across the world for the safe operation of nuclear facilities. We also conducted assist missions to these individual utilities, these individual countries, to help them applying these standards to assure that their facilities were operated safely. If I look back over the career, I've been very fortunate to have been recognized on several occasions. I received the Meritorious Award while a member of the United States Nuclear Regulatory Commission. In that same capacity, I was then honored with the Presidential Rank Award for Senior Executive Service. And in 2005, was more than honored to be part of the IAEA as it received the Nobel Peace Prize. As it Contributor in each one of these, it's been most humbling, but it's been very gratifying too to recognize that your contributions are seen by others as having made a difference. You know, when I look back at the beginning of my career and you, you try to put what's the safety of nuclear power, what's the hazard that it, it can provide, I remember something that my mother said. The first day that I had qualified as an operator on our nuclear power plant, she calls up and she says, are you afraid to be doing what you're doing? Because she now realized I was running a nuclear power plant. And at that time I said, no, I'm not afraid, but I'm very respectful.